Okay, so today I want to review my 132 Peterbilt 379 by Frank Lament. So this I just picked up today as a gift from my brother for Christmas. And this thing is, a, this 379 is pretty sweet. I mean, you can't get any more detailed even if you asked for it. A really good, really good example is the riveting detail along the cab. The, I mean, where do you, where do you start and where do you begin? Right up front you have your, like your rectangular bumper. Chrome grill with your, I think it's like three, what do they call them, the ribs? Yeah. And I want to say that's your flying, it's almost like your flying swan on the top of the grill. Never, like your flying V. Let me get it tilted. And I love this paint scheme. You got your caterpillar right down there, radiator. I want to say your turbos right over there. All of your equipment, drive line. And this is a heavy truck. I'll put it that way, it's heavy. So in shipment today, the passenger side exhaust stack actually came off. So I ended up having to get the what is it called the modeling glue out to get that hooked hooked back on and I'm gonna show you inside in just a minute I'm gonna turn it around the other side too so of course you have your 379 cab and it's a little a little on the narrow side like most of these but that is all right gotta love these narrow cabs Yeah, and I've seen this paint scheme on another another few model 379. So I don't know if Jada. I'm trying to remember if Jada did one. Okay, I'm gonna try and I'm gonna kind of turn the camera out for just a minute because I want to get this turned around. At the same time, I'm gonna focus my hands on the truck and not. Uh, on uh, the camera, if I can do that right, okay. So I just gotta be really, really careful because these exhaust, exhaust stacks are very, very brittle. I am not kidding you about that. So anyways, I got out the tester's glue and yeah, reassembled it, but that's shipping for you. And uh, the mirrors are actually metal, so you can move those out a pretty good degree. Okay, now for its party trick. Okay. And when it comes to most reviews, you don't often see the inside of the... What do you call it? The, the top of the roof cap. Usually in most reviews, they'll kind of like put this aside and detail on the inside, which of course is really nice. Don't get me wrong. It's got your very soft padded material in there. Of course it's plastic, but yeah, it's meant to simulate. But anyways, what I mean is on the the top right here you can actually see the upper bunk now I'm not sure if there's a pillow in there but pillow up there but that would be pretty cool so yeah a lot of a lot of detail okay let me just put this right back I'll kind of like pause freeze it for a minute 
So you can kind of see the access way through the sleeper onto the cab. And I think there's the little rubber accordion simulated right in there. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna set this right back down. There we go. Yeah, so the roof cap doesn't have a lock. So when you do pick it up, you have to really pick it up by the lower portion. Or you can hold it in your hands by the tanks. So anyways, you have your, uh, call it um, catwalk, your deck plating, yeah. Your Peter Belt on the flaps. Overall, really, really, really cool. Your chrome handle on the back of the cab. Reverse lights. I think those are either reverse lights or work lights. Cab extenders. Overall, very, very nice. Locker box. And of course your aerials. Now let me see if I can, I'm gonna set my phone down real quick and see if I can give you a look under the truck. Okay, let's see how this goes. Okay, I'm not sure if this is gonna come out, but if it does, it does. If it doesn't, it doesn't, but yeah. You can always just pause it and freeze frame, so. Yep. Okay, set it down nice and, nice and softly. Okay. There we go. So, that is, that is about it. Um, yeah, you can pretty much see for yourself all the other details while I was able to cover them. Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention, so there is real felt carpeting down in the cab and sleeper, so another cool touch to add. So anyways, I'll leave it at that, but I hope you guys enjoyed. You take care.